everybody! Sometimes I just like to be loud. So, new things. Got a new TV because, well, I wanted a TV because I sold my old one and I was supposed to get a 4K TV, which I did. A Samsung 6 Series 40 inch 4K. It's pretty friggin' awesome. I am a little sad. The lighting over here sucks. This speaker. I have blown, I believe, the mid-range, so it sounds like garbage when I turn the volume up. But yeah, this is awesome. The only thing I don't like so far, at least, Mass Effect is super pretty, but sometimes it slows down. This was done so I couldn't try, and I haven't tried any of these other games. This one, I'm guessing, will play like butter because it's old. Destiny, I'm guessing I'll have the same problems. We will find out. Tonight's project... Oh, definitely not cleaning. Don't care today. I'm bringing in an amp, an extra one, and I'm going to hook up my 12-inch dual subwoofer box from my old car because I need more volume and more bass. Then I'm going to hook up my surround sound speakers up here one somewhere around here, and the other somewhere around that light bulb. And if you're wondering what my surround speakers are... Uh, this is one. It's an indoor-outdoor smash-to-shit grill Yamaha. If you want to know more... Let's see if she'll focus. Uh... Model N3AV, huh, don't know, can't really read that. And, oh, here's the other one. Let's see if this one's more readable. Are these different model numbers? Because this one is an NSAW390. Maybe that's what that one says. Don't know. That's what it is. They work pretty good. But the big thing is over here. Focus. We now have quadruple monitors. I've wanted to do this for a long time. Crappy square monitor crappy square monitor. Those were donated to me from my good buddy Ernie. He wasn't using them anymore. This one was donated to me by my father. And that is a 1080p 21 inch? 27 inch? I don't know. Something 1080p Acer monitor. This one was donated to me by my ex-girlfriend. Some really weird resolution. It's an Acer, but I think we talked about that already in one of the other videos. But we got them all running. It is awesome. This is my new screensaver. I need to get more because I want a different one on each screen. This is my Star Trek system screensaver, obviously. And it doesn't really like quadruple monitors. This one and this one keep syncing up to exactly the same thing. And currently this one is not really doing anything. And of course we have my favorite mug. I'm going to go fill that up shortly. Have my morning hot chocolate. 
But today we do some video editing. We got my taxes done yesterday. But we have to wait till the 18th to file, I guess. And then I have to go to the bank, get my direct deposit information, deposit some cash. Then we're going to do some clothes washing. I think I said that already. Then we'll see. We'll see how long all of that takes. Oh, I want to deal with this crap. Because squeezing through here, not being able to get into the drawers in this, and not really being able to get into that drawer, I just can't deal with this anymore. But, I will show you my bad news for the day. Oh no! It broke! We'll just go ahead and throw that back on. Turn that off. Maybe not. Oh, I don't know if I ever finished explaining that, but spots in Mass Effect Andromeda, it stutters. I haven't gotten into any action parts yet in 4K, but that's the only bad part. Yes, bedroom is a mess because I was moving this and I kind of just piled shit around and my roommate who's moving is messy too and just do shit everywhere. But that's okay, she's moving. So, come out here, this is an old crappy house from the 50s. It's been impossible to fill all the leaks and as you see in the other videos, there's a lot of cracks in the walls. But it rained yesterday a lot and melted a lot of the snow. And as you can see, there is a lot of water on the floor. My dad thinks it's a good idea to blow it not into the sump pump, which is through there, and blow it all into the air, which obviously we all know is a bad idea. And you can see like here, there's a huge crack all the way down the wall. It's been repaired a little bit. And we really need a new furnace. This ancient thing we're having a lot of problems with. You won't be able to see because I don't have a flashlight and I can't turn the light on right now. But this, can I? Nope, that's not doing any good. But there's a little valve here that doesn't turn on. Oh, and that's our toilet and it leaks water, which is really not cool. But this furnace just sucks all over the place and it's old and needs to be replaced. And I'm going to start selling this fish tank stuff back here, because I don't use it. I'm trying to make room for stuff I actually use. And a bunch of old tools and crap that doesn't get used. Old record player that doesn't work. But, yeah. So, I'm going to put all these away. Get rid of that garbage. clean all of that crap and you can see I've started waterproof painting the walls but I never finished it because of depression and because in the summer I get really busy with work and you can't do it in the winter time because the stuff doesn't oh you can see here this was put on when it was too cold it just flakes off and I got a bunch more fish tank crap here I need to sell I figure out what I'm going to do with that tank in this stand and that tank I'm not selling. That tank I'm probably not selling because it was donated to me from my dad's girlfriend and they might want it back. Or maybe I will sell that one. We'll see. Probably sell that one and the stand or just scrap the stand and use the wood for other stuff. But it's time for my breakfast and to deal with this crap. So I shall return. Well, bad news. My closet fell down. Looks like it ripped through my drywall. So I'm going to have to redo that and put them in the studs in the wall. 
and yeah, that sucks. But good news, I got the due date on my, uh, what is that thing called? Car payment change, so now my two big car payments are on two different paychecks, and right now I'm about to set up direct deposit for all my affiliate codes, which I'm going to hopefully set up some more tonight. And I got direct deposit for my tax return also. So that's really good. We're gonna get that done. And then we're gonna deal with this. Oh, look, we got a visitor. Hey, Mike. Hey, Mike. Meow, meow. Yeah, that's my buddy. So, we're gonna do this stuff, see how much we can get done. Alright, it's been a couple days. That day I ended up falling asleep after editing the other video. And then I woke up to do a party, which ended up being in Muskegon, which is about an hour away. And I didn't get home until 4 o'clock in the morning. 4.30? 4.30. Definitely 4.30. And... I came home to my closet being down. I don't think that's in any videos yet. And yesterday, I was just so tired and sleepy all day, I just didn't really do anything. And so, here we're gonna continue this two days later. So, hopefully, we're gonna fix that. Put it into the stud instead of the, just the drywall, like I had. I see a couple of them didn't come out. Actually, yeah, I don't know what those ones are for, but whatever. And then we're gonna do this. So I have room back here, and I can set this area up for filming behind me. And yeah, hopefully this should be a pretty good day. So, update here. This is my first ever drywalling I've ever done. As you can see, I'm not very good at cutting, and this was a couple years ago. If I move all this stuff, you will find more mold down there, which is the reason I took this wall down in the first place. But we're going to ignore that. You will see this wall has been hurt pretty bad. And I need to figure out how to deal with the ceiling here and redo some pipes, but whatever. we deal with that later. Since this one, this one... And this one did not fall out. We are going to reuse this, even though they're at different heights because I'm lazy. This is also where the TV used to be. It was, the center speaker was hooked up here. Here, yeah. Because there's shit back there. Or there was, somewhere. And here, here, here and here were the wall mounts wall mount was connected but we're getting there I forgot I could just disconnect the bar from this and that made it super easy so yeah